Responding to a distress call from MV Marlin Luanda on the night of January 26, the Indian Navy announced on Saturday that it has dispatched its guided missile destroyer INS Vishakhapatnam to the Gulf of Aden. The British oil tanker Marlin Luanda is currently carrying 21 Indian crew members and one Bangladeshi crew member. The ongoing firefighting efforts on the distressed merchant vessel are being reinforced by the NBCD team along with firefighting equipment deployed by INS Vishakhapatnam in support of the crew on MV Marlin Luanda. The vessel currently has 22 Indian and one Bangladeshi crew members, stated the Indian Navy on X. The Navy reiterated its unwavering commitment to safeguarding merchant vessels and ensuring the safety of lives at sea. Yemen's Houthi rebels have claimed responsibility for the attack, asserting that the naval forces executed an operation targeting the British oil tanker Marlin Luanda in the Gulf of Aden. Houthi military spokesperson Yahya Saria declared in a statement that the group utilized appropriate naval missiles, emphasizing the precision of the strike. The US confirmed the Houthi strike on MV Marlin Luanda with the US Central Command reporting on X. On January 26 at approximately 7:45 p.m. Sana time, Iranian-backed Houthi terrorists fired one anti-ship ballistic missile from Houthi-controlled areas of Yemen and struck the Marshall Islands flagged oil tanker MV Marlin Luanda. CENTCOM further mentioned that the distressed ship issued a distress call and reported damage. USS Kearney and other coalition ships have responded promptly to render assistance and as of now no injuries have been reported. The recent incident is part of a series of drone and pirate attacks on merchant vessels in the Red Sea and parts of the Arabian Sea. The Indian Navy has heightened surveillance in the region and deployed task groups comprising around 10 warships in response to attacks on Indian bound merchant vessels. Since the beginning of the Israel Hamas conflict on October 7, Houthi militia backed by Iran has targeted commercial shipping in the Red Sea using missiles and drones. The Houthi rebels declared their support for Hamas, leading to heightened tensions in the region. Due to these attacks, several shipping companies have suspended operations in the Red Sea, prompting mariners to alter their routes and take longer paths around the southern tip of Africa.